Hi, and welcome back to English with Fliss. Today we're looking at the homophones, rap or rap. But before we get into it, please hit that subscribe button and the little notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos and don't forget to like this video. So you will learn the difference between rap and rap and how to use these words correctly in sentences. So let's focus on rap, W-R-A-P first. It means to cover or enclose something in some kind of material. So with presents, we use paper to wrap them in for with salad, like you can see on the right, we will use a flour tortilla or something like that. Um, an idiom that we could use would be wrap it up. If you don't know what an idiom is, I will link that video in the top right hand corner for you, um, but wrap it up. So if someone was telling me to wrap up this slide, they would basically be telling me to hurry up and get a move on. So let's wrap it up and go to the next sentence. Uh, sorry, the next slide, which is sentence examples of wrap. Okay, so we are having chicken wraps for dinner. Have you wrapped the Christmas presents yet? You're taking too long. Let's wrap it up. Okay, so that was the idiom, idiom example that I just used before. Now let's look at R-A-P, rap. So rap music is... Words that have been recited and are being performed rapidly and rhythmically. Another meaning of rap is to knock quickly and repeatedly on an object such as a door. So that's me rapping on the desk. Some sentence examples of rap, R-A-P. I love hearing Eminem rap. He had rapped on the door. So someone else, not Eminem. Who is your favorite rap artist? Let me know down in the comments. Mine is Eminem. And Ed Sheeran said that he had a stutter when he was younger. He practiced rap and it helped fix his stuttering problem. There's an interesting fact for you. I learned that from Disney's documentary on Ed Sheeran, which is really interesting by the way. Anyway, so let's test ourselves now on our newfound knowledge. So what I want you to do is fill in these blank spaces with the correct rap, the one starting with W or the one starting with R. So who has the longest rap song? It is really hard to rap well. She can't rap presents very well. Wrap it tight, otherwise everything will fall out. So um, pause the video, have a go, and then we'll check out the answers. Okay, so I hope you've paused the video. Now let's have a look at the correct answers. So who has the longest rap song, R-A-P? It is really hard to rap well, R-A-P. You could have also um, put in W-R-A-P, depending on where your mind went with that sentence. It could have been, it's really hard to rap. Yeah, I've got down below wrap presents well or wrap a tortilla well. So it could either way is right. So you're not wrong if you spelled it the other way. Um, she can't wrap presents very well. So that's only W-R-A-P. And wrap it tight. Otherwise, everything will fall out starting with W. Now we'll do that one more time. So test yourself on this page. Hurry up. Wrap up your story. The straw was in plastic wrap. He wrapped on the desk for attention. Can you wrap some lyrics? Can you wrap the gifts? So pause the video now, have a go, and when you're ready, press play and we will move on. Okay, so I hope you've paused the video and had a go. Now let's check out the answers. So hurry up and wrap up your story, W-R-A-P. And the straw was in plastic wrap. Again, W-R-A-P. He rapped on the desk for attention. Can you rap some lyrics? R-A-P. And can you wrap the gifts? So cover the gifts in paper. So how did you go? Let me know in the comments down below. And in summary, W-R-A-P, wrap, is to cover or enclose something in some kind of material. And R-A-P is our rap music that's been recited and been performed rapidly and rhythmically and or to not quickly and repeatedly on an object such as a door. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, 
please hit that like button, share it on to a friend and leave a comment down below and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.